Hello friends and welcome to another tutorial on Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to understand program which prints bracket number of a string. First, let us understand the problem statement. Given an expression of length n consisting of some brackets, the task is to print the bracket numbers when the expression is being passed. Next. Let us see the approach. We define a variable left bnum equal to 1. Then we create a stack right bnum. Now we iterate for i equal to 0 to n minus 1. If exp at i is equal to a left bracket, then we print left bnum, push left bnum onto the stack right bnum, and finally increment left bnum by 1. Else, if exp at i is a right bracket, then we print the top element of the stack right bnum and then pop the top element from the stack. Next, let us see the algorithm. We take a sample string exp and pass it to print bracket number along with the length of the string to n. Then we take a left bnum variable for printing bracket number of left bracket and Initialize it to 1. Also, we create a stack right bnum for right bracket numbers. Next, we traverse the given expression exp from 0 to n, which is 15 for our case. So, first, i will be 0. exp at 0 is a left bracket, so the if condition gets satisfied and we print left bnum, which is 1. Next, we push the left bnum onto the stack right bnum. So, 1 will be pushed into the stack. Next, we increment left bnum. So, left bnum becomes 2. Now, i becomes 1 and exp at i will be the letter a. Since exp at i is neither a left nor a right bracket, the if and the else if statements do not get satisfied and we continue with the for loop. So i becomes 2 and exp at i will be the plus symbol. Since exp at i neither a left nor a right bracket, the if and the else if conditions do not get satisfied and we continue with the for loop. So i becomes 3 and exp at i will be a left bracket. As exp at 3 is a left bracket, we print left bnum and push left bnum into the stack. Next, we increment left bnum. Now i becomes 4 and exp at i is b. As it is neither a left nor a right bracket, we continue with the for loop. The same will happen for iterations i equal to 5 and i equal to 6. Then i will be 7 and exp at i is a right bracket. The else if condition is satisfied and we print the top element in right bnum stack which is 2. Next we pop from the stack. So 2 will be popped. Then i becomes 8 and exp at i is a right parenthesis. Since exp at i is a right parenthesis we go to the else if part and print the top element in stack and pop it. So 1 will be popped and printed. i becomes 9 and exp at i is not a left or a right parenthesis so we omit it. Then i will be 10 and exp at i is a left parenthesis. The if condition gets satisfied and we print left bnum which is 3 and push 3 into the stack. Next, we increment left bnum. For iterations 11, 12 and 13, the if and the else if conditions will not get satisfied. Then i will be 14 and exp at i is a closing parenthesis. The else if part is satisfied and we print top element of stack which is 3 and pop 3. We finish iteration in the for loop and we have the final answer. 
with this we come to an end of this tutorial for any doubts or suggestions please leave them in the comment section below thank you for watching